Hello fellow creatives, it's day 28 of the 30 days of Painted Elephants Project and vlog every day in August. Only three days left, people. I loved yesterday's minimalist painting so much that I am going to do a similar painting today, but I'm going to change up my paint and I'm going to use Payne's Gray. I was introduced to Payne's Gray just this year. I'd never known about the color, I'd never worked with it, and it is an absolutely stunning color. It's beyond navy blue, it's like navy mixed with midnight blue with a little bit of gray. It's absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to substitute that for my black today because as you may know, I like to work with blues and greens. Whenever I look at my paint palette or when I look at my box full of paints, I always reach for the greens and the blues first. It's just, it's just what I do. So I have this image in mind. I found this gorgeous elephant with its trunk up. There's a photograph of it. And I'm gonna use that as my jumping off point and because I haven't done an image like that yet. So we'll see how that all goes and I'm using another one of my smash canvases. And for those of you that might not know what a smash canvas is, it's essentially an old painting that I put all my extra paint that ends up on my paint palette after a painting session. Um, my paint palettes often look like this, it's a magazine. And rather than just leaving the paint on here to dry and be a waste, I take that extra paint and I jam it onto an old painting that I don't love anymore. And I create these smash canvases with all of this texture and different marks and things like that. So that when I start off with the painting, I've got gorgeous texture and interest to start with. Um, sometimes I even, you know, use the colorscape as a jumping off point. So I'm gonna use another one of these smash canvases as my starting point and I'm gonna use white and paint's gray and that's it. And that is going to be my challenge for day 28 of my 30 days of painted elephants project. Let's do it. Well, I absolutely savored that painting. I only have a few days left of my 30 days of painted elephants project. So I am taking it all in, taking my time and enjoying creating for probably one of the last few times in this studio even. There's a lot of changes headed my way after beta is over. New studio, new house, new job. So I was just in the zone and loving every minute of it. This is where my soul shines. Thank you for being part of it. All done. Are you ready to see it? Mm. 
That is number 28 of the 30 Days of Painted Elephants project. I only have two days left with you. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. My goal is to hit 100 subscribers before the end of August. And if you liked this minimal color palette of just white and Payne's Gray, let me know by giving me a thumbs up. That's it for today. Thank you for tuning in. I will see you tomorrow.